What a crazy busy day it's been today. I've been working on a little bit of everything today. Uh, as you can probably tell in my voice, I'm a bit tired. I've been uh, having trouble sleeping lately. I sleep two, three hours, get up. And I know it's probably just from stress and all, but it's just taking a toll. Uh, <clears throat> As many of you know or don't know, I've been working on trying to start a t-shirt business, a uh, t-shirt and decal business, doing uh, heat press t-shirts. And I've started a YouTube channel for that. Uh, I've got a uh, YouTube set up, Twitter, uh, I have a Facebook, yeah I got a Facebook, and uh, Instagram set up for that and uh, I've also tr been trying to raise money for getting the equipment through GoFundMe that's not working uh, I've had it up the campaign up for two years it's, oh, it's like 25 months so a year, two years and one month and that's, that's just kind of too long to wait on donations to come in. I know it's kind of bad me wanting to get needing to get donations to start a business but that's the only way it's going to happen. Uh, I'm also been working on if anybody out there needs uh, custom Facebook covers or custom banners for uh, Twitter or YouTube. I'll even do custom YouTube banners too. So if you need a custom banner for one of those social media outlets, uh, just message me on here and let me know and we'll work something out. I still need to set up a uh, Google Wallet for the uh, t-shirt decal business. Uh, Sorry, my brain's blinking out. I've been, it's been a long day. But anyways, uh, I'm also going to probably start selling uh, YouTube banners for uh, for people's channels. So that's coming in the works. Uh, I'm about ready to do anything to make this happen. I've got a buddy who I've talked to a couple times. He said that uh, he placed an initial order, but I haven't heard back from him you know, about anything. I quoted him a little high. Well, I quoted him at retail for the shirts, 30 shirts. Uh, that's going to be $600 at uh, $16 a piece, and that's with shipping. Uh, I've also got a video of my shipping uh how, how I plan on shipping the shirts. I know 30 shirts at $16. He probably can sell them for 18 to 20 So there's a little bit of profit there, but it, it won't be a profit for me because i got to get all the equipment. But if anybody out there wants to set up an initial order, I can do less than that. I need the minimum order to be at least $300 to cover shipping of the shirts and shipping of the equipment and getting the heat press uh, transfers done. And there's going to be about a two, probably about a two week wait on everything to get here. So anyways, I'm going to end this segment here. I'm rambling on. Okay, I'm back at the laundry room. I know it's echoing a little bit. Got a Whirlpool washing machine. Yeah, it's a little bit old. But, it's doing this. Spin cycle has stopped. But it won't stop dripping. Anyways, I'm going to try. i got to figure this out. I can't keep turning off and on the water from the back. So, that is what I wanted to show you. 
Look what I come across. A little box turtle. And I think it's a box turtle. Turn it back over. Now these things are good to be left out in the wild. Don't try to make them a pet. Turtles carry salmonella. And uh, I'm going to go right away and wash my hands. But, never have a turtle with a pet. It's the same thing, it carries the same diseases as a chicken. A raw chicken. So, a turtle was a bad idea for a pet. I don't know if you can see it. Maybe you can. Looks like a white butterfly. On my mint. There it is. Flapping around. It looks like a white butterfly. I've never seen a white butterfly. Okay, YouTube, it's coming to the end of this video. I'm uh, going to end this with something I'd always love to have one day. I've always thought it would be a real nice idea, a neat idea to have. One day when I have my mansion, hopefully. <laughs> yeah. Uh. I've always loved the idea of having an indoor winter garden. Now, if you don't know what a winter garden is, it's a garden grown inside, uh, flowers, whatever, in the winter. You can have a sitting room in there. And, as fall approaches, all these leaves are going to be falling off the trees. Everything's going to be dying. In a winter garden, you can have... Summer and spring all year round. It's just one of my dreams is to have a winter garden. Uh, hopefully one day that'll be achievable. Anyways, I'm gonna end this video here. Like and subscribe to the channel. Click the link below to subscribe. Uh, follow me on Twitter, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.